Hi, Tim Roy from Warriors.com with Warriors 4 Brandon Wright, and it's good to see you. And, and uh, I guess the question that fans would want to know, how are you doing and how is the shoulder? I'm doing great, Tim. Um, just rehabbing, working hard, um, working out constantly, just trying to get my shoulder back in shape and just get my body back in shape. That's the biggest thing. The shoulder is the least of my concerns right now. Um, on that front, everything is good. Just got to keep it stretched out and loose, and I'm, I'm good to go. Tell me a little bit about your uh, workout regimen in, uh, in Nashville, back in Tennessee. Tell me about your, the things you're able to do and, and, and who is helping you guide you through your exercise. Well, for the most part, uh, every day I do rehab. Um, then I'll uh, lift weights. Then I'll head to the gym. I'm doing that five days a week, so uh, it's a pretty, pretty strenuous you know, schedule. I've been doing that for about 12, 13 weeks in a row, so it's been tough on my body, but I need to get my body in that place where it hadn't been um, over the last six, seven months. Now, as you started the process, if you hurt an ankle, you can still do upper body yeah. stuff if you have a leg injury or knee injury. But a shoulder is one of those places, sort of like your midsection, that you everything you do has shoulder movement. Talk a little bit about that and, and how frustrating is that? Yeah, that's the weird thing. Um, just, um, you know, the shoulder is it's, it's in a weird place, like you said. It's, it is similar to the midsection, where... I mean, if you run, you're moving your shoulder. Yeah, exactly. Uh, you know, you run in, you walk in, you turn your head. You know, it's still, everything has to do with your shoulder. So it was tough. But uh, I worked through those, those pains, and like I said, I just got to keep it stressed out now. And if I keep it stressed out, it's in good shape. You might be able to hear in the background that some of the players are working out right now, and, and uh, you see that. Is that kind of make you a little hungry to get back out there? Oh, yeah, definitely. Uh, you know, I got here earlier this week, so I've been working out with the guys. So it's, it's been a good atmosphere. We've just been hanging out and, you know, working hard, relaxing, just getting ready for uh, getting ready for next season. Uh, there's a lot of questions around here, but, you know, we still have fun. We still put smiles on our face and just enjoy ourselves. Now, for you, I know it's been frustrating. You've been hurt and you haven't played the number of games you want to play. But you're still a very young man. You would be, what, a senior this year? Uh, sure. I would have just graduated. Yeah, you would have just graduated. Yep. Okay. So, I mean, you still have a long career ahead of you. Do you find time or a place where you can remind yourself of that? That's the thing, you know, I, I still feel like I have a lot in the tank. <laughs> I mean, like I said, like you said, I'm only 22 years old, and you know the sky's the limit for me. And I have, I think I have, um, you know, unbearable potential. So I think you know, having a strong season this year and all the hard work I've been putting in, you know, in training camp, you'll definitely see the player that I was definitely going to become last year. And you had a great training camp last year up until the injury. Yeah, it was tough. You know, um, I came in very prepared, I felt well, everything was going good. The shoulder felt great. And uh, just one of those things where, you know, when it's going well and then something bad happens, you know. So, but like I said, I will be ready for training camp. What else have you been doing this summer? Uh, spring and summer? Well, just relaxing. Yeah. Um, my, like I said, my days consist of rehab, weights, and on the court. And you know, I pretty much just went home and put my feet up and watched some TV, watch movies and stuff like that. You know, watch all the sports that's going on right now. You're a baseball fan, right? I am. I Atlanta am. Braves. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they had a nice little role there for a while. Yeah, they're playing all right. Uh, I haven't checked the White Sox game right now. Hopefully they don't get swept, but uh, I hope those guys win the division and make the playoffs again this year. You watch any of the playoffs? Uh, a little bit. You know, I, I, didn't, I didn't put it in my phone and, you know, make it the top of my schedule, but, you know, when, you know, when, when it was time to, you know, watch, I did go watch. What do you uh, feel about, what do you see when you look at this team and, and uh, you being one of the young core of this ball club, what do you look at for next year? Well, I mean, it's, like I said, it's a lot of potential on this team, a lot of guys with a lot of talent. I know we stay healthy, and that's been the big question. Um, you know, we can compete with any, any team in this league, and, um, you know, we put the team out there that we want to put out there. We should be competing for the playoffs. Well, Brandon Wright, it's great to catch up with you, and, and uh, have a great rest of the summer. Thanks for having me, man. And we'll look forward to seeing you in October. Oh, yeah, definitely. All right. I'm Tim Roy for Warriors.com.